Hey guys, it's Dre here. Welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be doing my setup and you guys can go ahead and go check out my old setup in the top right hand corner of the screen. There'll be a card that's going to appear there. Go check it out and you guys can see how much my setup has grown within the past like three years or so. So since 2013 I believe. So let's go and jump straight into it. First of all, I still have the same keyboard I did uh, day one since I built my PC. So in that setup video that you guys in that you guys go check out. I actually have a laptop in that, so I'm not gonna have a PC in that, so it's gonna be a little bit weird. But I've had this exact keyboard since 2015, the d first day I built my computer. I've had this, and this isn't even, this is sold, it's not even USB. It's like the purple cable. I forget what it's called. I know, I know what it's called, but I can't remember it right now. But it's the purple cable, it's not even USB. That's how old this thing is. So going on to the next thing, we have my daily use headphones right here. These are actually Skull Cannon, the uh, Crusher headphones. And as you can see, there's a little knob right there on the side to where you can adjust the bass. I usually keep it halfway. I don't really like too much bass all at the same time. But these are really cool because they actually fold and contract like this. So you could like, you know, keep them stored away really nice and stuff and you can take them on the go with you. The only downfall with them is their cord is not that long. So your PC can't be that far away. Like mine's like right down there. So... We just have a little, some little things over here, like my girlfriend that painted me that. And then we also have the computer monitor right here, which is if you, a lot of people ask me, you know, what computer monitor do you have? Go on Amazon. If you literally go on Amazon, type in Asus, A-S-U-S, 144 hertz, okay, monitor. The first one that pops up, the 24 inch, 1920 by 1080p, 144 hertz, one millisecond uh, gaming monitor. That's the one I got. So... We also have up here my Logitech C920 webcam. Now, a lot of people are probably wondering, why do you have tape on the webcam? Well, the reason why I have tape on the webcam is because there are blue lights that emit where the tape are at when you record. So whenever this thing records me, giant like you get really bright flashing blue lights in front of your eyes and I don't really want that while gaming so I just went ahead and put over some tape over it it doesn't affect the quality of it at all or anything like that because obviously the camera's not covered up but that's why I have that like that my audio setup right here we have a uh, Audio Technica AT2020 USB Plus okay I don't remember to say USB plus because it's different so a lot of people ask me what microphone do I have I do not have the XLR version I actually have the USB version as you can see right here uh, this goes all the way down the arm down the back and actually into the back of my PC is where it goes so this is just the standard uh, Audio Technica AT2020 USB plus that you can buy on Amazon and this generally runs about like $150 It usually goes on sale for like 110 sometimes uh, This pop filter and this shock mount and this scissor arm did not actually come with it I had to buy, buy those separately myself So I bought the microphone first and then I bought the scissor arm which came with the shock mount and the pop filter So going on to the next thing we have my mouse and my mouse pad right here. So the mouse, I don't even remember what it's called. I think it's called like a Z-Lot or something like that. It's a $5 gaming mount or it was a $5 mouse that I picked up back in 2015 on Amazon. Really good mouse, has lasted me a long time and hasn't given me any problems. So we also have the Razer Vespula. This is a good mouse mat to buy if you want to. Over here, we also have two Xbox 360 controllers. We have one on the top that's regular. And for people who have been around on my channel a long time, you guys know I would I used to own a scuff. It's right there. It's sitting there collecting dust. I haven't used it. As you can see, if I lift this up, you can see how much dust is on it right there. And I literally haven't used it. So we got the Xbox One right here. We got the Xbox 360. Uh, we also have my Astro A40s, which I unboxed a long time ago on the channel. You guys can go check that out, too. I'll put a card on the video. We have the Astro Mix Ant, which is still hooked up to this day, and I still use it when I get on the Xbox for, like, whatever reason. We have a one ter yeah, we have a one terabyte hard drive that's plugged into the back of the Xbox One. We have a Nintendo DS Lite right here, and we have a knockoff SNES. That's not a real SNES. And we have another TV over here. So fun fact, before I actually mounted the TV, what would actually happen was I had my cable box right there, and I would have the TV with the bottom like mount like this on the bottom of it sit on the cable box, but it would be so unstable it would wind up leaning over so i decided one day just screw it we're gonna go get a tv mount so i went and got a tv mount and put it on the wall that way we don't have to worry about any of that and it swivels it moves wherever i want it to go so that's really cool uh and then if i want to like use twitch chat or i'm live streaming or something i hook my twitch chat up to that so that way i can see it at all times 
The next thing we have is, of course, the computer right here. This case is pretty new. I haven't had this case the whole time. Um, I had the Corsair Spec 2 until just last year, Christmas, and my girlfriend bought me this, which was really cool. So this is the uh, NZXT Phantom 410, and as you can see, it's got blue LEDs. They're actually white, but they're blue on the camera, and it, it emits a really cool light inside of it as well. On top of that, we have a... Just to run through the PC specs real quick, we have an i5-4590, 32 gigabytes of RAM, DDR3 that is, 500 bronze power supply. Um, we also have a CryoRig H7 tower cooler. We have a GTX 1060 6 gigabyte version, a one terabyte hard drive in it, and an SSD. So that's everything in there. You can also see down here is a two terabyte external hard drive for if I need any more storage, and that's also hooked into my PC. As far as recording games on Xbox and stuff goes, I have an Elgato back here. I'm not going to move the PC, but back there in the back there is an Elgato back there hooked up, and all I got to do, all I got to do is just hook an HDMI cable into it, and then it essentially records everything. So that's it. That's my whole entire setup, guys. We have the monitor, the keyboard, the mouse, the mouse pad, the headphones, the Astros. That's a pair of knockoff headphones. Uh, we got the Xbox One, the 360. We got the Astro Mix Amp. We got the hard drive, other hard drive, and we got the two TVs, the monitors, and the setup, and the webcam. So that's it. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you guys want to, go check out my old setup video, and you guys can see just how far I've come in the past like three years to this setup. That's it, and I'll see you guys next time.